Good morning, everyone. We are back. Um, it rained all night last night, but I uh, slept well in my camper. Uh, no visitors or anything, so that's kind of nice. Woke up. Um, already had some coffee, made some breakfast. Just kind of hanging around camp right now. It's about... What does that phone say it is? It says it's 8 o'clock exactly. So, um, it's still a little bit early to go fishing. It's a cool morning. It's about 40 degrees right now. Uh, got down to about 38 last night. And it's supposed to stay pretty cool and cloudy with a, chance, uh, blah, blah, with a chance of thunderstorms in the afternoon. So, probably gonna, um, you know, kick it here for another 30 minutes or whatever and then uh, hike down that trail and then go that direction as far as I can. I remember from last year there was a cool little riffled section that would probably be uh, not super fast. So I'll probably start there um, and then just work my way back here. If I get here by lunch, depending on how the, the bite is, um, I might transition to another area. That way I can fish that other area this afternoon. But that also depends on uh, what the thunderstorms are doing because if it's, you know, if it does what it did yesterday, I'm just going to hang out because uh, I'm not going to like try to go somewhere and reset a camp in a hailstorm. So, but uh, yeah, that's the plan for now. Um, got another little bit of coffee to drink uh, and then just put on my wet clothes. So I'm waiting until the last minute to do that because uh, I, I think the temperature, I don't think the temperature is supposed to be above like 55 or 58. It's going to be under 60. So nothing's getting dry. Solar shower is not looking like a plan today, so i um, glad I got to take one the day before yesterday. So um, didn't get to take one yesterday, but hopefully I can at least set up some water somewhere and just wash off all the the important parts, if you know what I mean. So um, anyway, that's the plan. So we're going to make it happen a little bit. All right, so it's nine o'clock. Decided to go ahead and uh, put on my wet clothes. Leave this jacket on. It's a little chilly. Uh, and go ahead and just start hiking. Um, start fishing. There's not any. Probably not going to see much like you know bug activity this early, but it's been mostly a dry dropper or hopper dropper event anyway. So we're just going to nymph. Um, just throw a uh, way to fly under a big foam pattern and. Uh, at least do something. I can't sit in camping longer. So that's what we're doing. Getting out. Snake. Alright, he ate. Last couple of fish have eaten. Kind of early for caddish just yet, but one of the stoneflies I tied up on the truck bed the other day. Just a little golden stone. It's a size 12.
Okay, so I was just about to leave. Start seeing some big mayflies, drakes, uh, casts are coming off. There's a bunch of fish rising through this pool, a couple of fish over there rising. So I'm gonna go ahead and stay. Uh, doubled up on my drive, got a caddis with a mayfly. There's a fish, a little small fish rising here, but it'll be fun to try to catch. Catch them on dry eyes. Just chill, chill. Trust me, dude, I'm gonna let you go as fast as possible. I mean, if that ain't just too much fun. 
pretty well, bro. All right, so looks like the rain's coming again. Having a good time chasing fish on dries and start sprinkling. So I started hiking, try to get back here. Haven't heard any thunder or lightning like that, but um, you can kind of see the, the line of rain. So I'm guessing it's gonna be here shortly, so I'm gonna go ahead and try to change some dry clothes. Yeah, I think the day is done. All right, so dinner is not gonna be super basic. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, chop up that last little bit of sausage I have, and then I'm gonna do those two cans. And basically I'm putting everything in the same pan because uh, I'm running a little bit short on water to wash dishes and the nearest place to get water, way down there. And I'm not going down there. So I'm gonna keep it as quick and basic and simple as possible and cook everything in this one pan and then hopefully use like not a lot of water to wash that pan. So, okay, so super basic. Gonna brown this. These are both pop tops. And then throw it all in the can. All the cans in the pan. All the cans in the pan. Almost seems like it should be a song. <laughs> so like I said, green beans going next. Kind of get all the Cracklings on the bottom up, what do you want to call them? Get all the flavor up. We'll let that cook a little bit. Cook all that moisture out. And then I'm gonna add those uh, Great Northern Beans. Oh, it's gonna be good. <laughs> great Northern Beans. All right, so I've added the Great Northern Beans. Just cooking everything down. Like I said, super easy, super basic. Everything's in one pan. I'm gonna eat this from one pan. Get out of here, mosquitoes. Um, mosquitoes haven't been nearly as bad here as they have, probably because I'm a lot higher and away from the water. Um, which is not necessarily a great thing because it leaves me limited options as far as like doing dishes. I can't just go down there and grab a bucket of water. That's, that's good eats. <laughs> Did I ever watch that show? <laughs> just me. Spent a lot of time with it. When I first started staying home with my kids, when they were like babies and nobody in my house cooked, I had to spend all my free time. I either watched ESPN or Food Network. I learned how to cook. I could walk down the grocery store backwards. Somebody had to cook. So my wife was working, so it was up to me. So I did all the, all the grocery shopping, all the cooking, 
all the laundry. Um, yeah, one spouse working, one spouse staying at home. Kind of, kind of got to be a team. So it's my job. So, uh, which is why I usually don't cook a lot when I come on these. Because even now, like I'm the one who does most of the cooking at home. So, there you go. Got to cook that down just a little more, warm everything back up. Ah, that looks good, doesn't it? All right, so I know I'm not emerald or anything, but that tastes way better than it looks, so.